So unfortunately, this is my last night at Wilga State Park in Wethersfield, Vermont, so <laughs> just sitting by the fire pit relaxing. I've got one board left to go on, and then I'm out of firewood at that point. It's been a good trip. A couple of nights up here. Got away from everything for a couple of days. It was good. Got a lot of content for the YouTube channel, that's for sure. <laughs> this is video number five I'm working on right here now, so not too bad. Had some good hikes around the trails up here. Did enjoy seeing all the historic uh, CCC uh, fire pits in the uh, nature trail area. So if you didn't see that, go back a couple of videos to my hiking trail video. Yeah, it was fun, uh, well, living in a van down by the river for a couple of days. <laughs> but, uh, now it's time to get ready to go home again. Back to work. It's been fun. I'm not going to say this is my most favorite campground ever. It was good because it was a place that was open and it was fairly quiet. I don't like the fact there's a hiking trail right there. So I get people on all sides of my van at any given time. It's unfortunate, but yeah, it's definitely gotten a bit busy here uh, for Thursday night. So I can imagine what it'll be like tomorrow night. I think the place is going to be full up tomorrow, but I'm taking off tomorrow morning. I haven't decided how I'm going to head home yet, but I guess we'll see. I'm going to try to make the quickest route, or if I'm going to take a more scenic drive. We'll figure it out in the morning. Anyway, I'm going to enjoy uh, my last uh, fire, bit of firewood here, and uh, we'll probably catch you inside the van a little bit later. Oh, boy. I'm just trying to do a little cleaning up in here now before I go to bed. And throwing things, apparently. Still throwing things. <laughs> uh, just trying to do a little bit of clean up here. Tomorrow I gonna get up, make breakfast, pack everything back up and hit the road again. Oh, it's gonna be so nice when I get this van set up so I don't have to set things up and take things down just to be able to camp. That'll be real nice. I have that sink in here, drainage tank and everything. That's going to be a nice improvement. But for now, it is what it is. This up here. I don't know where I'm going to make my coffee in the morning, if I'm going to make it in here, if I'm going to make it outside. Tomorrow I'm not putting my contacts on, just put my glasses on. I'm just driving home. I don't feel like making things too complicated. Oh, I'm tired though. I'm gonna be going to bed early. It's about 10 o'clock. I gotta charge my watch too, my watch battery's getting low. I do that too yet. All right. Well, there's nothing exciting going on in here. I'm just falling asleep here, so I guess I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning. Slept pretty good again last night. Uh, now it's time to start getting ready to go home. I got my coffee here though, and I'm taking a little walk down to the observation platform. See how things are looking out there this morning. And then it's time to Time to go back, make breakfast, pack up, and get ready to head home. So, that's what we're looking forward to today. Good coffee, though. Ah, oh, I did it again. I left the uh, image stabilization turned off because I was using it in the uh, HDR mode. So what happens is I turn the camera into HDR mode, which allows it to be get, get better night vision but it shuts off the image stabilization. <laughs> That's what happened here. So sorry about the shaky footage while I was walking down here, but anyway, uh, is the Connecticut River as seen from the observation platform. Yeah, nothing too exciting. I don't see any wildlife. It's a little overgrown here, but it's a nice little place. 
there is a waterfall across the across the river over there. I'm gonna pull out the other camera and see if I can zoom in on that for you so you can see it. Don't know how well this is gonna come up, but let's give it a shot. Well, hopefully you managed to see it in the camera. It looked like I could see it there, so... <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's pretty neat. A little waterfall right across the river there. Hard to see it, but it's there. I can definitely hear it. But thought I'd share that with you. Well, oh, good coffee. All right, I guess it's time to start working my way back to the van there and have some breakfast. Having another breakfast burger today. Okay, you've seen me make breakfast burgers before, so I'm not going to go into details on how I'm making it. Just suffice to say that I'm making it. <laughs> and it's going to be big. So yeah, I think I made the breakfast burger a little too big. <laughs> not even sure I'm going to be able to eat all this. But we'll see. we got uh, eggs, hash brown, ham, bacon, sausage, cheddar. Hmm. That's good, too. Alright. I'm not going to make you watch me eat this. We'll catch you up with you uh, after breakfast here. We'll start taking everything down. Oh, yeah, breakfast is done. Almost 10 already. I can't believe that. This gives me just a little bit of... Just a hair over an hour to get everything packed up and put away. So I'm getting ready to do the final dishwashing here. This van in driving mode here again. These window covers down. There's a little spider on my window cover. Ah, of course there is. <laughs> Oi. Ah, of course there's a little spider on my window cover. Oi. Eventually we're going to make some changes to this, but not right now. This one. Ah, just about done here. Making our final run up to the trash barrel. Drop off the trash and recycling. And do a final check around the campsite. Probably use... Oh, well, i got to clean the front seat off yet, still. <laughs> I will use the facility one more time and, and we'll hit the road. So, the trip is almost done. Let's take a quick look around the site, make sure I didn't forget anything. I did clean up a bunch of the pine cones for them last night in the fire pit. <laughs> uh, three bundles of firewood, all gone. That new wolf graphic crystal gave me looks great back there. She's going to be working with me to make some other designs for the van. We'll see how that works out. I could deal with some rust issues and give the van a good bath. <laughs> but for all, things looking pretty good here. Looks like I got everything. Well, the station's down, everything's ready to go. So that looks like it's it. We're all packed up, we're ready to take off. So this trip is done. Uh, I don't really have any plans for any place to stop on the way home. I might stop at a rest area, that'll be about it. <laughs> But uh, we're only about two hours from home here, so not going to be a big deal. I guess this is the end of this adventure, so we'll leave you with some footage of the uh, scenery as we drive home. And other than that, remember, slow down, enjoy life, and always be kind. Talk to you guys later. <laughs>